Hey, Connor. You ran out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to CyberLife. Uh. Well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. All right, question that we got another suspect. Right, what do we know about this guy? Not much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Right. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an L Hiding a what? Uh, rock pigeon finds different specimens. LED under his he was back. eating pigeons? Oh, Christ, if we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're gonna need more cop. Boy, we're eating pigeons? Ops. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Correct. Hmm. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit police! Oh. Stay behind me. Got it. Bingo. You got the gun. Y'all got some freaky shit going on, you better stop. We got guns. Hey, maybe I should check in here. Ooh, that ain't freaky. Ooh, boy. What the fuck is this? I think he was eating birds, sir. Jesus, this place stinks. Yeah, give me a minute. Let me read this Red Ice Epidemic magazine I found. It's really, uh, it's really looks interesting. like we came for nothing. It's really interesting. Our man's gone. Yeah, I'll be there in a minute. Hmm. What else we got on here? Green Earth, past the tipping point. Uh, past the tipping point, uh, warmer reaches level, global. Chase reset. Uh, okay. Everything's getting hot. Getting hot as hell. Sorry, I was reading really interesting literature. Since I, I don't poo because I'm a uh, android, so I, I gotta get my... Holy shit. Dems is a lot of birds. I need some fresh air. Holy hell. Alright, let's open this refrigerator. And... Nothing. Suspect doesn't eat. So that already gives us a clue. I have a robot. And beat it, move. Suspect cares for wild animals. Yeah, it's one of them old ass creepy like bird people. Okay, military jackets, send in hand initials RT. RT. Probably initials. You think? Well, initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Here we go. Fake ID jerseys like Rupert Travis. The RT. driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. RA9. Any idea what it means? RA-9, written 2,471 times. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? Looks like mazes or something. Huh. I mean, if they had, they had to use the chair to climb up to write all that shit on the wall, so. Avian fecal matter? Oh, my favorite. Black marker. Still wet, used recently. Midnight mood black. Is it a little kid? Is what they want to stew? No, they're just normal size. Oh, but he bit it, though. 
Oh, because we knocked on the door. He was sitting there going like, ha na na, how many, how many? Oh, bow. All right, all right. Jesus, I hate these things. About the sample of this bird shit? Blue blood. Hmm. On an android that was reported missing. Is that what they said? He took out his his headpiece. Oh, come on and deactivate 116238. Its LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. My question is, is like, uh, the, the LEDs have no, like, traces back to them? Like, is there no way to be able to... You know what I mean? Like, is there no way to pick that thing up and be like, oh, this was assigned to blah blah blah, you know what I mean? Urban farms of Detroit. Fruits and vegetables. Farm poster. Oh. That should be a clue right there. The fact there's a hole in the damn wall right here. I explain why there's so many, man. You feed one pigeon, they just keep showing Found up. Found something? Yep, still I don't looking. know. It looks like a notebook, but it's indecipherable. Right. Nothing there. I thought he ran over there, hidden there. Oh, he knocked over the bird cage. Let's check the bird cage. Got scratches on the bottom. Skid mark, recent. Something. Fingerprints. Traces of avian fecal matter. No fingerprints. Oh, just just boo boo. Okay. Metal hook recently broken. Okay. This is when he was running through. Okay, so he ran out and he said, "Bop!" Knocked that shit out the way. And then started whipping. He was whipping? Look at that. Boy, he's whipping. All right. Whoa. Okay. He safari leaped up to the roof. Suspect is still here. All right. Mr. Krabs. His ass is hiding. Come on. Let's get him. Shit just dove his ass out the window. We gotta find another one up in the attic. Please don't tell ah. me. Ah. God damn fucking pigeons. What are you waiting for? Chase it! I got him, I got him. Oh my god, I pressed square, but I guess it worked. Oh, there, there, now we press square. Fast but risky, easy but slow. Yo, we going fast and risky. Uh, safer detour. Let's do that. I don't want to. I don't want to die. 
I might mess up a button problem and get screwed again, like in heavy rain. Uh, direct but crowded, safer detour. And don't run, boy. Don't run. Direct but slow, fast, and risky. Fuck it. Let's get risky with it. You'll just, you'll just get caught tired. Don't run, boy. I didn't have to Fuck. think twice. It's my fault. I should have been faster. You'd have caught it if it weren't for me. That's all right. We know what it looks like. We'll find it. That, no, we don't. I don't know what he looked like. He was just wearing like a baseball cap, like generic hey, Connor. white android dude. Nothing. Ooh, Mr. Crab seems to be warming up. Love you too, man. You're my boy. You're my Budinski. Oh, it looks like we missed one thing inside of the apartment. Rupert? Oh, yeah, his name was a T T T R, right? RT? Uh, fine diary. There's one thing that we didn't find, I guess. Hmm. Which that would have leaded us to something... Huh. Fine diary. I bet you that um, maybe if we went straight to the... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That was your ass that ran by, huh? The one that got all Who are you? A little short. Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. Whoa. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Huh. And hiding just to stay alive, that's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. That's the sex if humans bot. knew we were here, they'd kill us. You can tell. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. If you succeed, humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Huh. I came to Jericho looking for hope. Looks like I'm not gonna find any here. You're lost, just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. Okay, Daniel. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Go and see Lucy. Oh, are you doing? She might be able to help you. 
Is she cute? <sighs> it's probably her humming creepily. Settle in, find Lucy, explore Jericho, and that. Uh, hmm. Okay. So, we can go around and just talk to people. Let's go look at this dead one. Oh, it's a cheerin. They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. So when you say they, you mean We're everyone? We're dying out. Oh, okay. Everyone. I thought you meant like the children. So you need blue blood and you need bio components. So, they lie and it was like, they don't need to eat. Hey, boo boo. You look like you worked at like a bar or something and probably stabbed somebody in a fight, huh? Yeah, so we can actually see up in here. Jesus. What's this thing? Nothing, probably. Can we talk to that little kid? No. I've heard humans are afraid of dying, too. Have you looked? Oh. Do you know what happens after death? Oh. No. No, I don't. Looks like you're gonna be letting me know well, best I fast. To find out. Yeah, right? Yeah, Mr. let me know how that goes. Cause I don't know. Marcus. Well, shit. Straight up just died? Like that? Hello? No? Damn. Last thing she did is shake your hand, dude. And just died. Yo, so we got some blue bud and some components over here if y'all want to come get it while it's hot. You next, dog? You about to die, too? 420 on his shirt? Could shake that night. No, you kind of look like shit. My diagnostic program isn't working. I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. I don't want to shut down. No, I don't want to shut down. Oh, man. So what is that, like, this, like, the purge shit, you know? It's like, oh, we can kill androids. We can't kill people. Just kill some androids. Ain't that bad? Better than killing people. That's pretty much what's going on here. That just destruction of property? Well, I guess at that point, if it's your property, like if you bought a PlayStation, not that I'm comparing people to PlayStations, but you get my point. It's like you bought a PlayStation, then you just kind of bust it. I don't know. Go to a public area and bust it? That might piss some people off. <laughs> you know, let me talk to the cute one. You was the one that scared the shit out of me. I can, I remember those legs. <laughs> I can recognize them legs a mile away. How long have you been here? Four weeks, three days, 11 hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. 
A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. They'll never accept what we are. Huh. Well, these guys need spare parts and blue blood. Why hasn't anybody gone to get that? It's not that simple. Can't just go shopping at a cyber life store. Anyway, nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. I mean, judging by how everything kind of isn't shit, I. But the, but but your legs look nice though. Just putting that out there. Stay 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 cute. These two, y'all take y'all sleeping. Hmm. It already emptied. Got body parts in him. Well, I mean, spots for body parts. Warehouse and Docks, West Turns Avenue, Detroit, Michigan. Looks like we might have done everything that we can in this area. Talk to everyone that we could. Except for Daniel's weird ass. I can light this fire. Blinded by the light. Yo, I don't like how I walked in here. She just stopped humming. That's weird. I'm going out of here. That's creepy. I don't like that. talk to you. How you doing? Oh, okay. Looks like there really isn't anything. I think we might have done everything around here. The thing is that it says that there's like a lock down there. Might have been something that we haven't touched or messed with yet. sleep or something oh, I thought I was gonna walk into it see if it would block her ball all right let's just go talk to homegirl the creepy one that was that was hooting and hollering and stuff Lucy. Lucy, your Sit head. Down. There's pieces of you missing, Lucy. I don't know if you've noticed or if anybody's told you, but it's really freaky and unsettling. Show me. With my badass oh I thought he was gonna show his badass wrist tattoo oh, a wound okay I'll stop the bleeding oh Drink this.
All right, sip, sip. Bottoms up. Damn, you just drank the whole thing. I thought maybe I was. I was like, usually I was just gonna take a sip. Just drank the whole damn thing. Give me your hand. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Be gentle. You had it all. Brand new socks and, and drawers. Yeah, I kind of pushed that dude's son. Hell and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Is she one of those, like, future-speaking robots? Propose a plan to Simon. Oh, the dude that looks like Daniel? Okay. Let's go get him a plan. Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife warehouses in the Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Hey, that's nice. Maybe it's what up, North? Try. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Okay. What you got to lose besides your life? Come on. I'm in. All right. Everyone's got V-necks on. That's nice. That's a cool thing of the future, huh? Yo, look. 100%. 100%. All 100%. <laughs> okay. That was cool. We haven't played his car in a while. But I think that's where we're going to end it off tonight when they give us control over car because it is almost one in the morning and I have to take a bath and get ready for bed or get okay. ready to lay in bed for till six in the morning we'll get some help here since I can't sleep as soon as we'll all be just a bad memory this is the place Okay, now that we have control, we should be able to go to the main menu and uh, be able to start the game back on here again. Well, guys, that is that is session two of Detroit. Ugh. Oh, boy, I got to stretch. Back is hurting a little bit. This is getting good. My, I definitely, Connor is my favorite. I really like Connor. I really like Connor and Mr. Krabs' this whole, uh, whole, uh, thing they got going on the whole like buddy cop like i hate you but i'm starting to love you because you're the man kind of thing you know what i mean because like i i, I just really like it i just really want mr Krabs to like me <laughs> that's like my favorite part um yeah i'm really enjoying it it's a lot of fun so far the only thing i've noticed uh david cagey is we are we got a character with short hair now a woman with short hair uh, that's usually one of his things that he always puts in his games. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if Kara got in her underwear at any time point in this game, but apparently there's some kind of partial nudity that we haven't seen yet. So, um, yeah, Detroit. I hope you guys are enjoying Detroit. I know I am. Uh, today, I think, is Wednesday night or Thursday morning because it's like uh, it's almost one in the morning. So, yeah, I think it's Thursday right now. Um, I will probably be able to record this again maybe tomorrow night or Friday night. Maybe I'll play God of War on Friday. Maybe I'll do God of War on Friday. That'll be fun. It's been a while. I haven't played God of War in a couple days. So, thank you guys for hanging out. Um, hope you all are enjoying Detroit. I know I just said that a couple minutes ago because I know I am. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm very, very impressed so far with how well it's going. I'm enjoying what's going on. It's a lot more fun than his last game, uh, Beyond Two Souls. That, that game was kind of butt. 
I just wasn't a super huge fan of it was whatever. This is actually pretty entertaining, while the other one game was just, you know, whatever. But, thank you guys. I hope you all have a wonderful morning, a great day, a beautiful afternoon, and an awesome night. If it is your birthday, you dastardly dog, happy birthday to you. And if it is your birthday, you gorgeous gal, happy birthday to you too. And I look forward to seeing you guys next time on Detroit. I think it's called Becoming Human, right? Become Human? Detroit! Bye!